So over the weekend, I decided to go to Ladybank to go see the cross-country trains that we missed last time we were there and also just to give it kind of a freshen up. However, first we decided to stop at Fife Heritage Railway because just to see how they were doing again. And please go check them out, they are an amazing place and they could really do with the support um, and they need the funds to build a new shed, so it would be great if you could support them. Thanks. <laughs> Then as I set up at Ladybank, the first train came along and it was 1B28, the 1339 Scott Rail service to Edinburgh from Aberdeen. Then this is 1L53, the 1356 Scott Rail service to our broth from Edinburgh. Then this is 1AL54, the 1357 Scott Rail service to Edinburgh from our road. Then this is 1A65, the 1416 Scott Rail service to Aberdeen from Edinburgh. This is 1B32, the 1441 Scott Rail service to Edinburgh from Aberdeen. Then this is 1L56. The 1456 Scott Rail service to Edinburgh from our broth with the smallest two tone I think I've ever got. I don't even think you can hear it. <laughs> the, the, the first one. And this is 1L55, the 1459 Scott Rail service to our broth from Edinburgh.
Then this was 1W11, the 1523 London North Eastern Railway service to Aberdeen from London King's Cross. Then this is 1B45, the 1846 Scott Rail Service to Edinburgh from Aberdeen. This is what I went to see. This was 1S45, the 1903 Cross Country Service to Aberdeen from Plymouth. Running after trees. <laughs> 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 Knackered. <laughs> then after that catastrophe, I'm pretty sure you'll be happy to hear this is the last train train of Ladybank, and it was one W twenty, the 1931 London Northeastern Railway service to Aberdeen from London Kings Cross. Thank <laughs> you.